there! I'm Mercedes at the Giveaway Ink Lounge where I can express myself. Yes, I can. Comadres y compadres, this segment I'd like to dedicate to the deadbeat dads. You know, I don't even like the way that sounds. Deadbeat dads. The word dad doesn't even belong in the phrase. So, comadres y compadres, let's dedicate, or I'd like to dedicate this segment to the deadbeat. You know, those individuals who sweet talk themselves, who were really nice when they wanted to get the uh in the uh and ah, uh, they're really quick to take a walk. Yeah, it wasn't all their fault, but they were really quick to take a walk. You see, those are not men. Those are men. Don't call them dads. Call them duh. Because they're duh. Mama's duds. Mama's boys. They're not men. A true man. A dad. A true dad. Somebody who deserves to be called dad. It's somebody who is responsible for their actions. Somebody who takes care of his family. Somebody who is supportive. That is a true man. But a deadbeat? What do you call a deadbeat? A duh? A mama's boy? A muh? To the deadbeat. When somebody asks you if you have kids or if you have children, what do you answer? I have an idea. When someone asks you if you have kids, I would probably recommend that you change the subject quick because to have kids and not take care of them makes you a deadbeat. Do you want the title of a deadbeat? Probably not. So just change the subject real quick. The good thing is that you have a chance at changing things for next year. You could still commit yourself to being a father, a dad, to taking care of your children. You can still do it. You can still be a dad for next year. Make it your task. Make it your responsibility. Make it your number one priority to be called a dad as opposed to a deadbeat. For next year, comadres y compadres, if this message applies to somebody who you know, all you have to do is share it. Send it to them. And remember, I'm Mercedes, and I appreciate that you guys have checked me out. Like me.